Strictly Limited Games' 23rd release for the Nintendo Switch is here, Taito's Ninja Saviors Return of the Warriors, based on the 1994 side-scrolling beat-em-up on the Super Nintendo. Join me today as we take a look at and do a quick unboxing of the Ninja Saviors Return of the Warriors on the Nintendo Switch. This is Half Circle Forward. Alright, so today we're going to be taking a look at the Ninja Saviors Return of the Warriors. This is the strictly limited release of the game, number 23 in their series. There are a couple of different releases of this game, but the strictly limited version was the one I picked up. So we're going to take a look at that today and see what we've got. Starting off on the front cover, obviously we've got some really nice comic book style artwork there. Uh, this is based on a 1994 Super Nintendo game, which was also based on an early 90s arcade game. So that's quite uh, expected there. And uh, this one is exclusive to the Strictly Limited release. Moving on to the spine, obviously, again, as I usually say, there's nothing particularly special here. Uh, just the name of the game and the Strictly Limited logo at the bottom. Moving on to the back of the case, there's really not too much to see here. We've just got four screenshots, the strictly limited release number, which is number 23. We've got the uh, slogan, Stainless Steel Heroes are back once again, which is an homage to the Japanese title of the game, uh, The Ninja Saviors, once again. And uh, each of the strictly limited games is sequentially numbered, so you'll see there's a little sticker there with the number 1662, which is my copy of the game. So with that out of the way, let's break this shrink wrap and see if Strictly Limited's put any extra bonuses inside the box. And I'll speed this up just a shade while I'm getting into it. All right, great. So let's take a look and see what's inside. Hopefully we've got some nice custom artwork. And it looks like we do. So it looks like there is an instruction manual here. So we'll move that off to the side. We'll take a look at that in a second. But it looks like we've got a reversible cover here. Let's take a quick look at this. It looks like we've got uh, the same comic style artwork and the same four screenshots on the back there with a bit more of a description. And while we're in here, we'll take a look at the cartridge. And that looks fairly straightforward just with the Ninja Saviors logo and the European Peggy 12 rating. Okay, so let's get back to this instruction manual. So looking at the front, again, we've got some slightly different artwork there, but again, the uh, comic book style that they've been going with. So flipping through the instruction manual real quick, we've got the overview of the story there on the first page, followed by a quick guide how to play and some basic moves. Then we've got a brief overview of each of the characters here, and then it looks like it goes into individual character move sets. So we've got Kunoichi, Ninja, Kamaitachi, Yakshia, Raiden, and Blaster Mode. So a pretty straightforward, simple instruction manual, but I quite like the way they've put that together. It's a nice added bonus. Now, also included in the game, which is pretty standard for any strictly limited release, is a postcard, which uh, just has the uh, alternate cover art on there on the front, and it's just a standard postcard on the back. And also as an added bonus with this release, they also gave us a really nice set of pins. There's a set of five there with all the main characters on. So that was a really nice added bonus. So that's the quick unboxing of Strictly Limited's 23rd release, The Ninja Saviors Return of the Warriors for the Nintendo Switch. I'm going to leave you now with the launch trailer for The Ninja Saviors, so you can take a look at the game if you are interested in picking this up. Like I say, there are multiple releases of this, and it is available on the Nintendo eShop as well. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please drop us a like and also consider subscribing. And don't forget to check us out on Twitter. Thanks for watching.